guys, welcome back to Life in Pink. Let's talk about the new development in the Cynthia Can't Pick a Man to Save Her Life, Bailey, and Mike Hill drama. But before we get started unpacking any of that, please take a second to make sure you're subscribed to the channel, like this video, and click the notification bell for all updates. We are on the road to 1,000 subscribers, so share the video please and thanks in advance. Alright you guys, according to page 6, Cynthia disclosed in new court documents that her ex-hubby-to-be, Mike Hill, allegedly did cheat on her. And that's the real reason for their divorce. Now this is in spite of her previously shutting down any infidelity rumors. Alright, so those court documents filed on Thursday in a Fulton County, Georgia courtroom claimed that the petitioner, aka Bailey, is entitled to a divorce from the respondent, Hill, due to inappropriate, adulterous relations and moral ethics in his conduct. Now, amid these new documents surfacing, Hill did comment to page 6 exclusively that the cheating claims made in the new court filing were an error. Mm. And his soon-to-be ex-wife's legal team is allegedly releasing statements retracting it. He goes on to say, I have love and respect for Cynthia. I always have and always will. As you heard in her own words, there was never at any time in our marriage any inappropriate adulterous relations. Our marriage didn't work out, but we still remain the best of friends. Now, it is important to also note that despite his denial, separate court documents also obtained by page six were labeled as motion to seal, which kind of reaffirms to some that there could in fact be truth to those allegations that he cheated. In that very motion to seal, it was noted that the divorce should be kept private because it may raise issues concerning both the moral character and embarrassing acts of one of the parties. Now, these facts are perceived to have a strong probability of potentially adversely compromising one of the both parties' reputation, image, business dealings, and will significantly harm the parties mentally, psychologically, financially, and emotionally, the documents also state. Now, if y'all recall, last year, which was actually one year after they were married, Hill was put on blast for allegedly sending photos of his private parts to another woman. I don't know about y'all, but it's looking and sounding like a duck to me. But what do you guys think? Meet me down in the comments. If you would like to support the channel by donating, the cash tag is linked below as dollar sign life in pink podcast. And as usual, I appreciate you all for watching. Special thanks to all of the new subscribers. Hey, y'all. I'll talk to you guys in the next video. Bye.